Hey, welcome back to Good Morning Vale. Joining us in the studio with Slifer Smith and Frampton, Hillary McSpadden. Her husband must be just kind of chilling out at home today because you guys do come in sometimes together. You used to do that a lot. I know. How are he, you? he was he was thinking about coming in, but you know, it's He's getting like, no, no, you go. <laughs> it's getting Bailey off to skiing today, so Yeah. Did you guys always. partake in any of the US Open stuff? It was crazy over there. Yeah, actually Steve went over the other day and yeah. said it was super active and fun to see Sean White win yesterday. Just saw him on the Today Show a couple weeks, or about a couple weeks ago, and yeah. I was like, I hope he wins, because he's working so hard. He is working hard, it's such yeah. a good event. It brings yeah. such a nice crowd of people once again to the mountains. Yeah. And you Absolutely. never know, maybe in that crowd of people, someone's looking for a new place to live. Yeah, especially at the Landmark. <laughs> let's, go to, let's take it over to 519 Landmark. Tell us yeah. about mm -hmm. the property. I love the Landmark, I love the location, mm -hmm. and I love Lion's Head. What is, what is it all about? Well, as you know, we've talked about the development for years, but Landmark 519 um, is a resale um, original owner. They bought it when the developer was building and did a lot of special custom uh, features. Is but, this up, up, up top? Yeah, up top on the far west end. Okay. Beautiful. Two it plus is beautiful. End. Um, you got some vaulted ceilings even being on the fifth floor and views from Beaver Creek all the way to Gold Peak with a wraparound patio. This beautiful. is a two bedroom plus the den. Yes. How big is it? It looks nice and roomy. You know, you're about 1,800 square feet. Okay. Master bedroom looks at the ski slopes, which is really nice. Um, as we've talked in the past, Landmark, you know, Lion's Head is tiered, so you get these amazing views because you're backed up on the north side. Uh -huh. So it's just incredible. And people walk in and like, can we just hang out sitting here and watch it snow? And then you and go this? look over the rail and you look down five stories and there's right. the hot tubs right. and the pool mm -hmm. that is even raised up. So no one sees that from the village, but it's right. all right there. Yeah. You know, the cost of ownership, I think, is fantastic at the landmark. Um, for a two, two plus den, you're paying about 1100 to 1300 a month in association fees. Um, you have a full-time front desk, Destination Resorts is on site, so oh, nice. it makes it super easy whether you just want home care or you want to be in a rental program. And then if you want to just meander into the village and go ice skating or send your kids down yeah. to go grab pizza right. or something like that, it's, it's so accessible. Mm -hmm. You're right there next to the bus route if you want to take the bus into town, into Vail. Mm -hmm. You know, that's, I think the benefit of Landmark is the location. You're right, you have the general store right there, all the shops and restaurants, you've got the ice skating rink, and super easy to get to the gondola. Um, that's the, the location of views, that's what it's all about, right? And that's yeah. what Landmark has. Um, a great, you know, I think it's a great time to buy. You yeah. know, things are very active. We don't have a lot of inventory, um, but um, there's excellent properties out there, and it's a good time to look and get in the game. I like the fact also, I just like to keep these little things pop into my mind. Right there where the ice rink is, mm -hmm. which you can practically look right down onto it, Vail Jazz during the summer, which is the longest, one of the longest events of the summertime, so you right. can sit on your patio and have a cocktail and listen to great jazz music on top of it. It's perfect. I mean, it really is perfect. Yeah, and the, the amenities at the Landmark Residences, you have an amazing pool deck. We've talked about that in the past. Yeah. I mean, you don't find that a lot of the buildings in Lion's Head, um, fitness room, ski locker storage. I mean, you're walking right in off the village promenade. Yeah. Excellent location too. I mean, it's a lot of the families that are there already, they can just let their kids go out. Exactly. And it's, they've got their backyard right in the village. And it's the best Pretty backyard. Cool. I know. I mean, really, what's well, a blessing to be able to have that, to have that mm -hmm. comfort and that safety and that convenience all in one spot. Absolutely. Yeah. And we've talked about our development. We just put one of our other two bedrooms under contract, Landmark oh, 515. Because you only had a few left, I thought, right? Only two, so now down to one. Oh, boy. So, and, and they've never been rented, brand new residences. So it, we're open Wednesday through Saturday, 2 to 5. If you want to come over and see it today, um, we're around. Just call us and we'll pop over to open things up. I've got your number right here. Can I and shout it out? Yeah, you can. There it is on the screen, too. <laughs> um, Hillary, thanks. Good to see you. Yeah, pleasure. Thank Good you. Good luck with everything. Nice yeah. to see you. Give Hillary a call if you want to find out about these great properties over the Landmark or any other properties with Slifer Smith and Frampton. Her number, 390-7632. Or you can uh, log on to their website, ownvale. Dot com. That's where you're going to go. We have more of the show coming up. We'll be right back. This is Good Morning Vale on TV8.